Hi, this is Eric Martin of Board Game Geek. I'm here with designer Andre Spiel, uh, co-designer of Wild Catters, which is debuting at Spiel 2013. And this is a hefty box. Yeah, you got a lot of stuff in here and a, 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 lot, it, yeah. a lot on the board. So hoping you can give an overview of what the game is about and what we're trying to do. It's a minority game. It's a, you play all the role of an oil company and you get minorities of shares, shares from the oil companies, uh, minority of um, money, and minorities of delivering oil to the continents. Uh, the game works in a way you pick. Uh, you take this card mm -hmm. and you're following uh, action A till H. Yeah, Every player does it. You pick a card, the first action is A, you pick a card on the side. There are always eight cards open. And for example, I pick this card. I put it here. Yeah? Uh, in that action, in that area, you can do your uh, oil action and your building actions. Uh, in this area, there are uh, four uh, oil rigs. You can uh, uh, build another oil rig. So let's say the blue player is on its turn. He take another oil rig. He builds it, he pays for it. He pays four money. And then uh, we go further. We, we go do our oil actions. You pay eight money to the bank and you exchange one of your oil rigs for for an oil pump and you put a supply of the oil pump on it, three oils. Um, it's an, um, a game uh, that you work together. You need uh, four oil rigs to do the drilling so the other people work along. We like interaction in games so the other players, yellow and green, can also exchange their uh, drilling rigs for an oil pump in my action. I paid for it and they can also put it open. They only have to pay three shares of their own to me. So I exchange it. Oh. And also yellow. There are all, uh, always uh, three, uh, three oil. That's a supply. Uh, it's a little bit uh, sorry for it. So, okay. And then the game is called Wild Catters. Wild Catters, uh, there are always wild catters in an the area. They are independent people around uh, 1900. Uh, especially in America, they, were, uh, they bought all rights of ground to uh, search for oil there. There was oil found in this area, so it was a lot, uh, the right. So we want to sell it to every uh, people who's active in that area. There's an uh, auction now, and you bid with your own shares. Um, the, um, green, uh, you, you start with an action player. So for example, green, green plays, um, pays of, uh, bids four uh, of his own shares. Uh, the blue player bids five, and the yellow player passes. If you pass, you're out. Green also passes, and the blue player um, place one oil barrel on the wildcat fiche and place the shares to the bank. Then we come, uh, if, you've, if there is already uh, oil found in the area, you can always exchange oil uh, rigs for oil pumps and you got to pay three money to the bank. And then uh, you can, ch the last oil action is a transport, you can see below here. And every Oil pump now can transport, if the action player pays for it, can transport one oil all over the world to the refineries. And he can choose his own transport, trains or tankers for example. So, at that moment we take one oil barrel, also the wildcatter. I travel over the green train because there's only a green train in that area. And then the green player decides to go along. It's a free choice. He travels by his own green. And also the yellow player decides to go. 
blue pays with his own shares and he pays to the green player because it's the green train. And the yellow player also pays with the yellow share to the green player and they're all standing here with the harbor. The next step is you can go from here by that train to a refinery or load it on board. Here, the blue player decides to go on the tanker. The green player goes along. The tanker is filled up three places and he pays for it. The yellow player goes by the blue train to the green refinery. He gets paid and the blue player decides to travel uh, with a boat. That's the last transport action. He, des he decides to travel to this refinery. And you can see on the refinery there are five places. Uh, so he delivers it all and the refinery is filled up. Yeah. So we're going to go through these uh, various, uh, the auction phase for um, placing. We're, we're, we're also, so this is the whole series of actions. You've, you've outlined the number of the different actions that are yeah, possible right. within the turn. Uh, what's the general length of the game? Two hours. If you, uh, first time, it's a little bit longer because you got to learn the game. But you can, uh, with four players, you can uh, do the game in two hours. And how does it change just from, uh, I assume it's also a two player, first you can do two, three or four? Uh, you can do, uh, we set on the box three or four players, because... Um, you need that competition, I guess, yeah, the, the infrastructure yeah, in there as well. Better. And if you want to play it with two, it, you can also do it, you play two companies, that's a possibility. All right, well thanks very much for the overview, okay. take a look. Thank you.